Hey guys, what's going on? This is my C2 and others, and today I'm going to do a review of this game called Carnivores LE, and that stands for Light Edition. So this is going to be the demo, not the full game. This is what the full game includes. There you go. Pause the video if this was too short for you to read. Anyways, the, I'm going to be using the iPad 2 for this video. And as you can see right there, this is the iPad 2, not the iPad 1. So here we have four options. We can go to hunt. And we can pick one, two, three, four, five, six areas to hunt in. We can go day, night, or dawn. Um, but of course, the light edition only allows one map for you to hunt in. Um, and then the survive mode. Well, I'm just going to show you what this mode is. Let's see if it's the camera's focus here. And you just have pretty much one gun, which is a shotgun. And you get to shoot these dinosaurs and the we coming at you. But of course, the LE version, light edition version, doesn't let you... Uh, play on an endless cycle you have to stop somewhere in a light edition and yeah we're gonna actually stop right over here and we'll go to escape done we can also go to trophy And this is probably where they're going to show you what kind of dinosaurs you hunted. And of course, this is light, the light edition, and you can only hunt one dinosaur, I think. Pretty sure it's one or two. Um, and more, you know, more options, whatever. Actually, let's go ahead and look at the options. Measurement, metric, by meters, sound, volume, sensitivity... Uh, graphics quality is on high so yeah firing method I like everything just the way it is let's go back and let's hunt we only have one place to hunt in cannot get this guy so we're gonna have to hunt for the Allasaurus I don't even know how to say that let's go ahead and check that now we can only pick a pistol which is of course not very good. Tranquilizer. Huh, I guess we can hunt this guy right here. Kinda of funny. Anyways, um there we go. I think you can actually unlock the um other gun. Okay, I think we're hunting these guys right here. Come back here, come on. And you also gotta be careful because you can be eaten by these things. And as you type tap on the screen, you can jump. The graphics are, of course, you know, not bad for an, a mobile device, but if you actually look at the ground or any other textures, uh, it's pretty bad. So this is not where, what we're looking for. And you also gotta uh, think of conserving your ammo, ammunition, ammunition. You can also resupply. But yeah, so you can see there's a blood trail, and we're gonna follow the blood trail because we shot the dude. We're gonna want to find him. Where does this go? There we go. I see him.
But this guy takes a few more shots, I guess. You also have the binoculars. Come on. Oh, there we go. Ah. Son of a bitch. Where's this guy going, man? He's making my review very hard to do. Since I just want to kill this guy and show you guys what happens after you kill him. Come on. Shot this dude like a million times. Bro, I, I was probably missing a few times too. There he is. For some reason, he does not attack you. That's probably because he's a veggie eater. This fat ass lizard. <laughs> run. Run, Forrest, run. Come on, where is that damn dinosaur? There's his blood trail. I'm not sure if they actually bleed out in this game. Maybe they do. Okay. There's always uh, multiple dinosaurs that you want that you are hunting, not only one. Okay, come on. Where is this dinosaur? Anyways, this is like taking way too long. Well, you get the idea. Um, once he, he dies, some UFO kind of thing comes up and picks him up, which is kind of funny. And I was like, "What the fudge?" what the fuck when I first saw him and like yeah anyways thank you guys for watching peace out